Hey, welcome back. My name is Sushant Sutish, and I am your instructor for this MS 700 Teams Administrator Associate Certification Examination course. In this demonstration, I'm going to teach you how to access security reports and alerts for Microsoft Teams. Microsoft 365 Security Center provides report that allow you to monitor potential security threats in your organization. Even though threat security reports may not be directly related to Microsoft Teams, they might alert you to suspicious activity that is threatening security for your organization. Microsoft 365 Security Center contains a dashboard that displays reports from different sources, including following categories identities, data, devices, and apps. Let's closely look at all of this in detail. This category of reports provide data from Azure AD Risky Users Report and Global Azure AD Admin Roles. Reports are related to Microsoft Teams because of sign-in activity to Microsoft Teams from different types of devices. Data category of reports provide data from multiple sources, such as users with the most shared files, DLP policy matches, false positive and overrides. Reports are related to Teams because of data shared and accessed by Teams users. Under Devices category, these reports provide data from Microsoft in tune on devices at risk, device threat analytics, device compliance, malware on devices, and users with malware detection. Reports are related to Microsoft Teams because of large number of mobile devices where Teams is installed. Under Apps category of reports provide data from cloud app security on threats from different apps, such as privileged or auth apps, suspicious admin activity, impersonations and cloud activity geographical locations. Reports are related to Microsoft Teams because of different apps that are integrated with Teams. Let's go and view a few of these reports. I am in Microsoft Security and Compliance Portal. You can access this portal by going into protection.office.com. To access this report, you can go right to the bottom of the left-hand corner, click on Reports, and then select Dashboard. You won't see much data on my portal, but right under Threat Protection Status Report, this is this is where you can get a single view about malicious content and malicious email detected and blocked by Exchange Online Protection. This report can display detection up to 90 days. Explorer is a near real-time tool used to investigate and respond to threats in Office 365. Explorer displays information about suspected malware and fish in emails and files in Office 365 as well as other security threats and risks to your organization. And security admins can create alert policies that will inform them when a shared document in SharePoint Online, OneDrive for Business, or Microsoft Teams has been identified as malicious. To create an alert, you can perform these following settings from here. On the Create Alert Settings page, choose the alert activity, for example, Detection Malware in File. And you can choose the thresholds, for example, every time an activity matches to the rule. And you can set your recipients in the next page as well. That's how you set up reports and alerts for Microsoft Teams in Microsoft 365 Admin Center. The next lesson, we're going to learn about labels. So I will see you in the next video. Till then, take care.